Hello and welcome to Trans TV News Summary. I am Ibrahim Youssef. The News in Brief. Troops of Operation Forest Sanity involved in the ongoing military operation in Kaduna State have destroyed a camp belonging to a notorious bandit, Lawal Kwalba, located inside a forest at Rapindawa in Chukun local government area of the state. According to the Kaduna State Commissioner for Internal Security and Home Affairs, Samuel Arwan, the troops conducted a patrol to the location following actionable intelligence. Meanwhile, President Mohamed Buhari has charged the military not to relent in its offensive operations against insurgents in the northeast. He said his government will be focusing attention on orphans and widows of conflict. The president said this during the commemoration of the World Humanitarian Day in Maiduguri. Minister of Education Adamo Adamu says the implementation of the federal government's no work, no pay policy is the only condition delaying the truce with the Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU. The minister, who spoke on Thursday to newsmen at the State House in Abuja, however insisted that government will not pay striking workers for the five months they were on strike to deter such occurrences in the future. And lastly, Chinese President Xi Jinping and Russian President Vladimir Putin will both attend the G20 summit in Indonesia, according to Indonesian President Joko Widodo, who will host this year's gathering. The 17th G20 Heads of State and Government Summit will take place in November on the Indonesian resort island of Bali. And that wraps up Trust TV News Summary for this hour. For more news, you can subscribe and follow us across all our social media platforms. I am Ibrahim Yusuf. Thanks for watching.